Cincinnati police officer killed in the line of duty remembered by two different people, each with a unique perspective. It was more than four decades ago when Charles Handorf was shot and killed. And Nine on Your Side's Tom McKee shares the two stories of men who knew Handorf well. Tom? Well, the name of Sergeant Charles Handorf was right here on the Cincinnati Police Memorial in the West End. And fellow officers, friends and family members are never going to forget that night in 1974 when Handorf was gunned down in Sailor Park. And that's also led to a very unique bonding. Nick Handorf and Bob Robel have nearly become brothers over the years. What brought them together was the tragic line of duty death of Cincinnati Police Sergeant Charles Handorf. That's Nick's brother. Nick is the youngest of 15 children. Charles was the oldest. He's a great guy. Nobody ever had any trouble with Charlie. Robo was next to Sergeant Handorf when he was shot. Everybody always had uh, good things to say about him and how innovative he was as far as being a, uh, a copper. The tragedy happened on December 8, 1974. Robo was a Delhi Township police officer called to Sailor Park to help Cincinnati police with a SWAT situation. Herbert Murs barricaded himself inside his house on Home City Avenue and wouldn't come out. Taking cover behind a wall, Robel was soon joined by Sergeant Handorf. All of a sudden, Murs appeared at a window. He came up and uh, uh, just started firing, okay? And uh, we fired back, and uh, when the shooting was done, I was able to get two rounds off. It was that quick, okay? He went down, I turned over and uh, saw Charlie on the ground next to him. I took his pulse and um, he was gone at that time. Sergeant Handorf was remembered Friday at the old District 3 headquarters in Price Hill. It's become an annual service next to the Handorf Memorial at the base of the flagpole. That job can throw anything at you at any time and you just always have to be prepared, ready, and uh, you know, alert. So unbelievable, it's a, to this day, I, you know, every time I turn around, I, I think about him, you know, it's just, just it's, I never forget about him. Very emotional, a very unique bond there. It was later determined that Merz was killed by a shot from Robles' gun. But Fleece Memorial with Handorf here, 1974 to 1987, there were a number of officers killed, 10 in all, Lofton, Lolly, Birdsall, Seifert, Bennington, Henzi, Weber, George. I have a been in the city working for a long time and I covered a great many of these, all tragedies for their families, for the officers, and of course, for the city. Tom McKean, Nine on Your Side, live in the West End.